little guy. Oop. There he goes. Let himself let himself go. <laughs> Mosquitoville. There are thousands and thousands of mosquitoes all around us and they are trying their best to eat us. Well, we got a bait rod out. Very nice day otherwise. No no real wind and the water's looking good. So anyway, beautiful scenery and uh, we are going to get chewed by mosquitoes. I do have some uh, spray on, but as you can see, <laughs> they are everywhere, guys. So a lot of mosquitoes. Um, we'll see what the bite looks like. Uh, we're going to start out with a bait rod and maybe switch to a spoon or do a little bit of both. All right, stay tuned. We'll be back. There he is. All right, let's get him back out there. All right, guys, we are getting chased and chewed by those mosquitoes. So we switched to double bait rod. We're looking for a quick bite. Oh, look at that. We're getting hit on this rod. Let's switch over to the chest mount. Another possible bite here. Let's see if he'll... Commit to the bait. There we go. Yep, I think we might have him on there.
pretty active back there for a couple of, a couple of casts, you know, about an hour and landed those four. Well, lost one. I lost a couple actually, but pretty good. We're gonna move, try one more spot before getting out of here. Let's go check it out. Well, we're gonna wrap it up here pretty soon. We are posted up in just this last little spot and uh, pretty good bite up here at North Lake. Not the best. Oh, look at that. Just as I'm saying so, there's a bite on that rod, on that far rod right now. Yep, let's go get him. A little guy. There you go. Number five. So as I was saying, the bite's pretty good. Pretty good out here. Um, it is nowhere near historical standards, but uh, it's fishing pretty well. A lot of the fish are pretty small. And like I said um, in earlier videos, that is pretty much the narrative up here in the Sierra these days. Not a whole lot of big ones left. And look at that, another bite. All right, let's go get them. There we go, big old hit. Oh, missed him. He bit it and spit it. All right, we'll get it back out there. So definitely a much better bite here at the second location. And uh, we're just about out of here, guys. Only gonna spend about an hour out here total and uh, basically did what we wanted to do out here which is see how the bite is and what's what's left here at North Lake this is another one of those lakes that had had its heyday man I tell you what float tubing right out here uh, so many years ago I found out this lake is is uh, about 50 feet deep it does not look like it at all but you're looking at like a a trough between that grass over there and uh, over here there's there's literally like a canyon out there it is really deep does not look like it but it's uh it's over 40 feet deep out there it's somewhere between 40 and 50 feet um we measured it with a float tube anchor 50 foot anchor dropped anchor different spots and yeah it's pretty deep out there so Definitely could have some holdovers in this lake. They've got the breeding habitat with the inlet. They got an outlet. I mean, this lake is prime time. I really think they should uh, convert this to a catch and release artificials only lake and put some bruisers in here. Um, but then it would just be crowded. So, you know, Southern California fishing. Another little guy, but hey, they're all fish, you know what I mean? Let's get them off of there, guy. Oop. There he goes. Let himself, let himself go. All right, let's get another one. 
So this is what we were using today. Uh, my stales in orange worked really well. It doesn't always do the job, but today it got the job done. So pretty good stuff. I saw another bite on this rod. Let's set the hook and see. Oh yeah. Yep, he's on there. All right. Great little day out here, guys. Nothing big, but just good old fashioned fishing. Oh man, he spit it. All right, we're gonna get this one out and then we're gonna start packing up. All right, that's gonna be it. We're headed to the car. Stay tuned for the wrap up. All right, that's gonna be it from North Lake. Not bad, guys, not bad. I mean, yeah, the fish are tiny, but hey, the bite's good. And uh, I can't say that about many Sierra Lakes these days. And beside that, I mean, look at the scenery. Look where we get to fish. I mean, not bad, guys, not bad at all. Some great, great scenery. But hey, like I said, uh, it's not about uh, quantity or quality, but the fact that we're getting fish at all. I mean, fishing game is struggling with the plants and it's a problem here in Southern California, guys. And this is what you can expect in the future is action like that. So be thankful. <laughs> all right, guys, we're out of here. See you on the next one.